Hi, D again. Today I want to briefly talk to you about the topic called Indications of Mechanical Ventilation. Mechanical ventilation indications are when a patient cannot maintain spontaneous ventilation to provide adequate oxygenation or adequate carbon dioxide removal. Apnea, when a patient cannot breathe at all. Or, ineffective gasping breathing. Acute ventilatory failure. Acute ventilatory failure stems from oxygenation issues or ventilation issues, such as a PCO2 greater than 50 millimeters of mercury or a pH less than 7.30. Hypercapnic respiratory failure or hypoxemic respiratory failure with a PO2 less than 60% on FiO2. A pending acute ventilatory failure is when the patient's CO2 is rising and the patient is having severe oxygenation problems, which can possibly lead to ventilatory failure. With evidence with the patient having tachypneic, tachycardia, high blood pressure, and increasing work of breathing. Prophylactic can reduce the risk of shock can also reduce the risk of hypoxia in the main organs such as the heart or brain, can reduce the risk of cardiopulmonary stress. Most often used in post-operative anticipated hypoventilation due to a decreasing in vital cap.